okay so yeah. this is this is kind of like a sand one word it's kind of like a sand dune rocky uh sand pit um th okay think of sand dune rock <laughs> have you seen have you seen uh, it's it's a major filming location. Like I don't know how many times it's come up as a filming location. We're like, oh, man. kind of like that. But what would you a smaller version that anyone would just go film at? There may be a lake and sand dune, and you would jump off, or it could also be a construction site. Um, it's it's it rhymes site? with. Think of uh, the Maury po Think of Maury, the Maury Povich show. Are you familiar with that? <laughs> It rhymes with more. It rhymes with. <laughs> this is going to like this is horrible. It's, this is perfect. This is perfect okay. television. Us struggling is perfect. So, okay. <laughs> it rhymes with Maury. Think of a sand okay. pit. A rhymes sand with pit. Maury. Uh, Some sort of sand pit location. Google this. <laughs> uh, I'm googling this. What else can I give you? Okay, not not here we go. No, 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 don't Google it. We'll get it. Not a not a nickel, not okay. a dime, not a nickel, not a dime, but a what's next? Nickel, dime. Looney or no, Looney? under, under that, under that. The 25 cent piece. Quarter. Yeah, so take the <laughs> first. Yeah, so take the first bit of that and rhyme it with Maury. Query? Got it. Quarry is freaking hard. Quarry is freaking hard. <laughs> okay. Oh man, that's fun. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what, what do we know about a quarry? Sorry, my English is not as good as yours. You know that. <laughs> that's just a tough one. That's a tough one, though. I had trouble explaining it. It's because it, it goes both ways, right? It, it's almost how good are yeah. my clues kind of thing, you know, as well. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. What do you know about a quarry? I know that we film there all the time on shows that I location manage. They're always looking for a quarry. If you go to um, the south of Iran, we actually have a lot of quarries. We have, um, like we... We actually have, it's not a studio, but it's like a place where it's created for, so what, what do you use Query for mainly? Um, well, we used it for, I mean, if, we if used it for use someone it to film, jump why off do you a use cliff. It for? Yeah, so we used it for a character was running from an alien and they reach the edge of the quarry and they have to jump off the cliff and drop a hundred feet into the water to escape. So it's like a beach, okay. it's like a rock, sandy desert, yeah. forest mix. It's, 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 it's actually funny because like we do have a lot of those in, in the south of Iran, but um, we have a very famous film, uh, both internally and internationally. It's called... Um, uh, uh, harmonica and everything is actually based <laughs> off of um, like kids who are playing in the south of Iran and they're constantly jumping off quarries just to have fun. It's not for a, you know if somebody's following them or whatever, but it's like yeah, they're yeah. not running away. It's like a a lot of those stuff. But for me myself. I have never used it in, like, I have never been on a set where I needed to jump off a quarry, but I've done it so many times for myself. Like, I, I like, yeah, a lot of people do it. Uh, the south of and then there are so many quarries that you go and jump off of. It's yeah, so much fun. fun. Yeah, for fun. That's what they do it, I think, in It, in It One, I think. And, and many movies, like, all, all those types of movies, like Stand By Me kind of thing or something, they go to a quarry and they jump off or something, you know? It's like a fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly, exactly. Cool. I, I, what we did go to uh, uh, like a very high mountain for this series that we are doing, and we were like, we had our car, me and my um, 
girlfriend sort of we we went to a um, cliff and we had our car right on top of the cliff and we were like standing right there and we we're thinking of jumping off and then we decided not to and we're but like you know all the bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> okay that yeah. was good next one oh okay two words um okay not not closed but not okay. closed yeah and this is like a saying so two words it's a saying that someone is like oh you can ask me anything i'm an uh open-minded person <laughs> kind of open book i'm an open book there you go Woo! Woo! <laughs> are you an open book i think so I think so too, but um, I, I have to say also not because I also play my cards very close to my chest if I don't think I know you or trust you or something like that, you know? So I'm a very open book with a lot of people, I think, even strangers, but certain times it just depends how I'm feeling if, you know, I'm, I play my cards close to my chest on how I'm feeling, what I'm thinking mm -hmm. sometimes, that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. I think I'm, I'm the same. I am an open book to the people who I know, but not to the people who I don't. So, um, yeah, I think I'm pretty much the same. But even, well, here's the thing though, even with strangers, like say I'm talking on a dating app, I'm a fairly open book on a dating app too, but I guess maybe I'm also, I'm still also a little bit closed off about personal things on there. So I guess yeah, it's me too. I'm the same. Yeah. Cause uh, personality wise, I think you and I are very close in terms of like, how we sort of um, connect with other people. Um, okay, holy cow. I don't know what this is. I know the first two words. This is gonna be a tough <laughs> one. It's gonna be a tough one. You would probably know the second one. Okay. But uh, the first word is, is if you get bitten by a snake or a spider or something that injects venom into you, what's that venom called? Shit. Or, or um, and it's probably not even as complex as you're thinking. It's just like, oh, I drank the wrong thing, or I'm trying to murder you. Let me sprinkle a bit of this like in a, your drink. Uh, I think, blank uh, ivy. You run through the bush. Like and a poison. Get, there, that's the first word, and then the second word is. <laughs> I don't know what it is. So, but I'll try and explain it anyways. Okay. So um, I'm going to have to cut the word in, in two. Do you remember where I'm from? Sault Marie. Do you remember the short form of that? Sioux, the Sioux? Yeah, so that's the, that's the first half of the word. And then the second half of the word is blank and cheese, a macaroni dish that's easy to make. Uh, sorry, I got... Um... Blank, and, che sec, just... blank okay. and cheese, a macaroni dish that's cheap and easy to make. It's yellow. Blank and yeah, cheese. Yeah, it's uh, blank and cheese, like a mac and cheese. Yeah, so so where I'm from, the short form of where I'm from. Okay, two. And then the big, yeah, and then leave out the end cheese. And it's just the... <laughs> the sumac? Oh, yeah. okay, poison sumac. Woo! Yeah. Do you know what that is? What is it? I I have no fucking idea.